The following is not medical advice. I'm just reviewing what I purchased based on the research that I found. On my left here is regular berberine, which I've been purchasing for a while. I've had good results with it. And then on my right here is dehydroberberine, which is supposed to be a more bioavailable version of berberine with uh, supposed to be less gastrointestinal discomfort, more bioavailability, and effectively uh, a better product. Uh, it is a little bit more expensive, but um, we're just going to open these up just to get a good look at it. I'm going to link in a few studies that I found online that have more information about that. I'll let the doctors talk about that instead of me. I'm not a doctor or medical professional and it's not medical advice. Okay, so what do we got here? Uh, well, here. You get an idea. They're a little smaller. It says dehydroberberine here on the right and regular berberine on the left. So the berberine is a little bit larger, a little bit more pale. And then dehydroberberine seems to be a little brighter and a little smaller size capsule. Um, but uh, this company's pretty good. Um, what's it called here? Deal Supplement. Uh, I've been purchasing these uh, Deal Supplement uh, vitamins for quite some time now. Um, wish they'd come up with a combo of CDB choline, alpha GPC all in one. That would be pretty smart because then you hit the long and the short term benefit of it. But uh, that's near here or there. Um, back to this. Hey, thanks for watching this video. I'll include affiliate links for both. Uh, don't forget to thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. We'll catch you on the next one.